400 people may be nothing compared to Chernobyl, but the risk is still there, and we don't really know what's going to happen. But the fact is the future of nuclear energy should be heavily looked at from this perspective because it's very, very expensive. It's three times more expensive than other energy sources. It does have the potential to be very dangerous. It takes an enormous amount of time and energy to get one of these reactors up and operating. So why even bother with this when there are other energy sources that we could be looking at that could be online in a much faster, much cheaper way? Well, wait a second. This is pretty clean energy. And you know what? To be fair, we haven't had any kind of accident of this magnitude in a long, long time. Well, you got to remember, though, nuclear is, it's great, it's great, it's great, until it's bad, and then it's really bad. And the fact is that we don't hear about a lot of these accidents. There was a report that just came out in the last couple days that talks about in 2010, there were 14 near misses at reactor sites in the U.S. alone. Now, those could be major issues, or they could be relatively minor, but they were considered near misses, and two of them were security breaches.